Explorers and Pioneer session with me, Sam. It's great to have you watching. Let us know in the online chat where you're watching from, who you are. We want to say hello to you. Now, some of you might be thinking, Sam, why on earth have you got a Villa top on and not your kids' top? Well, I can tell you that because I am an Aston Villa fan, but also this month's theme is called Super Fan Cheer Each Other On. You know, I've been a Villa fan my whole life. In fact, the other day I found the first Villa top that I ever had. Here it is. Look how small this is. Yes, I used to fit in that. So that was my first Villa top from when I was like five or six. Um, and I'm hoping to keep that so Zach can fit in it. But I am a Villa fan. I've been a Villa fan my whole life. I want you to let me know in the comments or in the live chat, who do you support? What team do you support? Maybe it's football, maybe it's hockey, maybe it's rugby. It doesn't have to be football. But let us know in the chat what team do you support? You know, this month we are looking at the theme of kindness. Because as Christians, we need to cheer each other on. And the way that we cheer each other on is by showing kindness to one another. So we're going to look this month at how God showed us kindness and how we can show others, our family, our friends and random people how we can show them the kindness of God. So let's get started with session one. Here we go. coins get those coins get those coins get oh man I mean, everybody knows that's a trap i can't believe you did that what that's so awesome hey welcome to the so-and-so show i'm john and i'm brandon Woo! Did you know that an estimated 145 million greeting cards will be sent this month? Wow, I did not know that. Yeah, yeah, people have said that the greeting card is a go in the way of the dinosaur, a dodo bird, or gremlin cereal. Ha, ha, classic. But I say no, I'm a huge fan of greeting cards. Me too. And do you know who else I'm a fan of? Who? Oh. Mail carriers who deliver those cards. So it's time to play rain, snow, or hail. You still get your mail. Woo! Yeah! <sighs> Ooh, these are nice blue shirts. Here's how this works. Brandon and I are going to climb aboard our mailmobiles and deliver greeting cards filled with kind words to the mail baskets you see here. The first person to deliver a card to all three of these destinations wins. Sounds kind of easy. <laughs> oh, well, I forgot to mention the snow, hail, and rain. Oh, ho, ho, ho. yes, you did. You did forget to mention that. Ha, ha, ha. Okay. Go! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Hey, I oh, one. I got one! I got oh, one! I got one! Oh, oh, the rain! Oh, it's snowing! Woo! It's warm, warm water! Woo! Oh, hey! Oh, oh, I got two! Woo! We're tied! We're tied! I'm getting so wet! Oh! oh! You know what? I think I'm done with this game. Yeah, me too. So, Brandon. Yeah, John? We're going to address the uh, Hans in the room. Oh, I think we should. <laughs> Me too. Ha! 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 Hans? Hans. 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 
Hans. Hans. Hans. That is my name. Do not allow it to slowly erode through overusage. Uh, everyone, this is our friend Hans. Uh, he thought it would enhance the overall sound atmosphere of the show if we had a studio audience. So This is correct. So we put him in charge of getting one together. Yeah, th then we had second thoughts. So we tried to call him to cancel, but apparently Hans doesn't have a phone. This is correct. Ha, 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 et cetera. What? Ha, 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 et cetera. <laughs> What's so funny? Did you bring your own sign holder? He comes with me everywhere. He's very quiet. Why are you the only person in the audience? Ah, I called some people, but no one came. I thought you didn't have a phone. This is correct. I do not have a phone. But I do have a window. Hello, people. I am Hans Decibel, audio engineer. You will come to a show with me. You will have a great laugh. Ha, ha. But no one came. But not to fear. I brought a dummy and a change of clothes for variety. We're going to get back to the show. Yeah. Yay! <sighs> It's uh, Bible story time with Kellen. Huzzah! Hurrah! And more phrases like this. Hey guys, what's going on? <laughs> Did I say something funny? No. We've got a Hans in the studio audience. Yay! You have a studio audience? Yeah, but don't get used to it. Boo! Take it away, Kellen. All right, then. It's cool that we have a fan in the audience today because it actually goes along with what we're talking about. The truth is, we can all use a fan sometimes, right? When we're feeling down or when we've messed up. It helps that we have people in our lives who are kind of like our cheerleaders. Oh, that's our cue, oh. Jackie. I heard it, Dee Dee. We're here for you, Kellen! Yeah, go Kellen! Woo! And sometimes it helps to have actual cheerleaders. This is Dee Dee and Jackie, the cheer squad. They are here to cheer us on. But not only that, they're here to help teach us how to be cheerleaders for others. Does that sound about right? Oh, yeah, we're ready. We're... Jackie, are you ready? Yeah. Let's do this, Dee Dee. to one another. Sometimes that's all it takes to be someone's cheerleader. Just be kind. But don't take my word for it. Here's what the Apostle Paul wrote in his letter to the Ephesians. Be kind and tender to one another. Sounds simple. And it can be, especially if you're being kind to people who are kind to you. But Paul goes on. Forgive one another just as God forgave you because of what Christ has done. Sometimes people aren't kind to you. They're rude even. How do you respond? Are you kind and forgiving like Paul wrote? Or are you rude back? What do you say, cheer squad? Hey, Jackie. Yeah, Dee Dee. What do you say when you gotta forgive someone? Oh, I say this. I forgive you, I forgive you, not because it is kind, but for what Christ has done. I forgive you, I forgive you. Woo! We should be kind and forgive not because it's easy, and not even because someone has earned it. We do it because of what God did for us. He sent his son Jesus to die for our sins. Now, that wasn't easy. 
and we definitely didn't deserve it, but that's how much God loves us. That's how kind he is, and that's why we should be kind to each other. Well, help us remember what we've learned, cheer squad. You ready, Jackie? I was born ready, Dee Dee. You know what they say. No one minds when you're being kind. Here we, Here go. we go. K I N D N E S S. K I N D N E S S. What can you do when someone's life's a mess? K I N D N E S S. How can you help them with all that stress? It's not always easy, this I must confess. K-I-N-D-N-E-S-S. But we should do it because of God's faithfulness. K-I-N-D-N-E-S-S. K-I-N-D-N-E-S-S. Woo! K-I-N-D-N-E-S-S is how God expects us to treat one another with kindness. Now, let's give it up for the cheer squad. Yay! Go cheer squad! Go cheer squad! Great job, cheer squad. Way to go. Go cheer squad! Kindness sounds so simple when it's in a cheer. Yeah, but we know it can be hard. Kindness is one of those things where the more you do it, the easier it gets. Thanks, Kellen. No problem. I'll see you guys on the flip side. You know what? He's right. Kindness does get easier the more you do it. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to start right now. Hans, I'm sorry. I should be more kind to you. You really are a great audience member. That's just great. I poured my heart out like that for nothing. Well, hey, you know what they say. No one minds when you're being kind. <gasps> you're right! <laughs> Oh, reveal the question. What does kindness look like? Oh, it looks like this. Yeah, uh, it could also look like giving up your place in line or saying please and thank you. Uh, oh yeah, or, or it can be big stuff too, like uh, letting go of a grudge and forgiving someone. Mm -hmm. Aww. Hans is back. Yay! Yeah, that's awesome. Well, I, I, I... Well, I think that's our show. And it was a good one. You did great, John. Hey, yeah, so did you, Brandon. Thank and you. so did you, Hans. We'll see you guys next week. Yeah. See you next week. Aloha. Woo! Yet again, another great episode of the so-and-so show. And so challenging to think about the fact that God is kind to us, so we need to be kind to others. So you need to be kind to the West Brom fans out there, okay? Anyway, we are going to have some discussion questions in our small groups and discuss this theme further. So if you've got the Zoom details, head over to Zoom and get signed in. And if you're watching this on demand, please do join us next week online at 9, followed by Zoom small groups. And also, don't forget that today, the 7th of February, we have got Kids Tribes Live and it is 4pm today here on our YouTube channel. There's a chance for you guys to vote for some leaders to do some challenges, but also a chance for you to win a prize for your whole family. You don't want to miss out, so join us on YouTube 4pm today. If you're watching on demand, we'd love you to join us on Zoom next week. So we'll see you on Zoom or we'll see you soon. Have a great Sunday. Bye.
วลา